Now, here's a question. Do you have the right to be forgotten? Yes, you heard me. We have no understanding what privacy is as a culture anymore. And there's this big court battle coming along. And we'll be talking about this more today and in days to come. In Spain, there are 90 people who are suing Google, saying that they want all reference to them removed, that they have the right to be anonymous. They're not public figures. They're not politicians. They're not TV stars. They are private individuals, and they have a right to their anonymity. Do you think you do? Do you think you should? Now, Google is, you know, routinely refuses these kind of requests. People are all the time submitting, saying, you know, hey, there's something embarrassing me about me on the web, and it's not even true. And when you do something about it, and Google just says no. Yeah. Because it would threaten the open Internet. So, a fundamental question here. What's more important? Or what value are we going to attach ourselves to? Keep in mind, I mean, the web has only been here for a fragment of this generation. Google's only been around for a decade. You know, search engines have only been around for 15 years. What's more important, personal privacy or an, a wide open internet? What do you think? I mean, there's been a, quite a discussion about this in our chat room uh, over the over the break. Do I, you know, there there is there are these two balancing things, you know, on, on the on the one hand, the right to privacy to not be out there to not be to not have things about, you know, assuming you're not a public figure, you know, just setting aside all the Donald Trumps of the world or even, even you know, talk show hosts like me. Um, but just people who are just going about their daily life and they're not trying to be in the public light. Do they, do you have a right to say to Google or Alta Vista if they're still around or whatever it may be, no, take me down. No reference to me, please. 90 people in Spain say, yes, we have a right to privacy, we have a right to be forgotten, and you will forget us. And Spain has issued a court order requiring Google to do this, and Google says, no, we're going to push back and we're going to fight this in court. I just find this fascinating. I find it absolutely fascinating. Also, uh, well, just just a few other things. There's a there's a great blog I, uh, over at. In fact, I even forwarded it over to Bernie Sanders' office. I was so blown away by it because it's about Social Security. You know, it's one of his favorite topics, and uh, it's titled "Social Security: Little Secret That's Fooling Even Most DUers," as in DemocraticUnderground.com. And it's that the projections that have been made about when Social Security is going to run out of money, and not even run out of money. In 27 years, we're going to get 70% of our benefits, but up until then, it's 100%, and then it's going to drop. Those are based on the assumption that the economy is going to grow at a 2.5% rate for the next 27 years. When, in fact, the, the economy has grown from 1960 until 2010 at an average rate of 3.2%. The actual growth rate last year, 2010, which was a pretty crummy year, was 2.9%. Excuse me, I misspoke myself. They're assuming the growth rate is going to be 2.1%. 2.5% of what would be necessary for there not to be any crisis at all. Any, and crisis is even the wrong word. It's buying into the whole Republican meme. And so this, uh, Manny Goldstein posted this thing over at Democratic Underground, and it's really worth checking out. Is there's uh, some fascinating stuff there. There are a lot of great progressive websites out there, and uh, this this uh, and by the way, Truthout has now the new chapter. They 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 started the day before yesterday. The new chapter of my book, Unequal Protection. We're serializing. We're giving away the entire book for free, chapter by chapter, a chapter a week, and I'm doing a video for each one tonight. My daily take video. Maybe it's going to be tomorrow night. Uh, for our TV show, our evening TV show, is going to be on Chapter 6 of Unequal Protection, which will then show up next Tuesday on uh, truthout.org. So check that out.